Now, notice this is the man that fears the Lord and that delights greatly in his word. In other words, his word means something to you. He didn't like any other word. He didn't like nothing else. It's greater than. It's, it's, it's more than. It's, it's life to you. <clears throat> he says, wealth and riches shall be in his house. And his righteousness endureth forever. Unto the upright there ariseth light in the darkness. Now you'll find, if you've served, if you've served God for any length of time, you'll find that this happens all the time. Light arises. Light comes. Uh, continually. If you, if you stay and feed in the Word, feed on the Word, light is always coming. You might, sometimes you might read a bunch of stuff or you might read some stuff. It may not dawn on you right then, but as you, as you walk and go, light will come on that subject. All of a sudden, some, some, an avenue will open up and you'll see something that you never saw before. That's light. You remember we talked a few weeks ago about Proverbs chapter 4 and one of the verses there it says the path of the just is as a shining light it shineth more and more unto a perfect day that's the path of the just when you get on that path when you start you just have a little light but the more you walk with God and the more you travel this road with him brighter and brighter, and brighter, and brighter, until sometime down this road, it gets full light. You finally begin, you can see something, and you put the thing together. Amen. Glory to God. Are you listening? Now you might just have a certain amount of light. That's okay. We ain't done yet. We got a ways to go, don't we, Herb? We ain't done yet. And so light is coming. So there, this is you can count on it. Light will rise in darkness. This is a dark world out here we're living in, but we have light, thank God. And God can help us. There's too, there's, there's too much to say in a program, but God can help us. He'll bring light to us. He'll guide us. He'll help us on the inside if we'll learn how to listen to Him. He'll keep you out of trouble. He'll keep you out of despair. Desperation. He'll keep you out of lack. If we'll learn how to follow that. This is what a lot of people are failing. Don't know how to do that. But we're going to have to learn how to do that. Amen. This is the only life we got. As we know it here. This is the only one we get. We don't get a do-over. <laughs> we don't get up to about 90 and say, Whoop, whoop, I get a do-over. I get to start over. I'm going to get it right this time. No, we better get it right right now. It's the only one we got. Right. This is it. Right. Amen. Now, we've got an eternity to live. But this life we're living right now, let's get it right. right. Amen. Now, so you can count on it. Light is going to rise. He'll keep you from troubles. He'll keep you from the, the snare of the devil. How does the Lord do that? How does He do it? Because He will let us know. He'll talk to us. I, I wish, I, I hope how soon that we all can learn how to be checked. Checked. By the Spirit of God. Checked. You ever been checked? Hmm? It, do you know what that is? I know what that is. Checked. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. 